Hi, welcome to today's video. I'm Jose and this is Adriana and we want to talk to you about what it means to build on a budget and we're actually going to look at it from two different angles. We're going to talk about it from a business perspective but then uh, we're also going to look at it from a life perspective in general. Now, the concept of building on a budget was something that um, I personally struggled with at the very beginning. Um, you've probably been in similar situations where you're maybe down on your luck or very tight financially and it's very easy to make excuses at that point and put yourself in a position where you let your circumstances determine your results. And um, I want to really challenge you to go against that because, first of all, it's not going to get you anywhere. And, and second, it's very discouraging, right? So it's very easy to kind of get sidetracked and think, well, you know what? If I don't have a budget, then I'm not going to make it or I'm not going to succeed. And, and really what it comes down to is that You've got to figure out a way to overcome that. Now, let me give you an example. Um, if you think about the Special Olympics, for example, these are these are people that are perfect examples of being in a in a disadvantaged position, but uh, rising to the occasion and not letting their their physical circumstances determine what they can or cannot do. And I've seen some of these these people literally in wheelchairs do things athletically better than I could. Like. Uh, you know playing basketball and things like that and it's just a very very inspiring to see that kind of thing now the concept of building um, something on a budget is very much the same it's just about um, your willpower and determination to do something so Adriana is going to share a couple of uh, maybe stories or some insight as to how we've been able to do this uh, even even just outside of business how we've been able to do this in uh, in our life as well have you ever struggled to get uh, something either financially or, or something that you really want but you don't have the money for it? Um, sometimes it could be uh, medication if you get sick and you need a specific treatment but you, you simply can't afford it for whatever you're, you're being laid off from work or you simply don't have that income. Um, I think that's a perfect example. Uh, we do have three kids and they do have um, they've been diagnosed with asthma since babies and um, just keeping um, the treatment up today uh, for three children can be quite expensive um, but we've been able to to break free from that and uh, it hasn't been easy but we always get there and I think it's more so what it's getting us through all these situations that most of the time you really can control is that like Jose said it's that the willingness the, the set of mind that you have that you're going to overcome it and I think that's something that everyone is able to do not just financially but even um, with for example a health issue if, if you're diagnosed with cancer you simply don't give up right you you fight it you work your hardest you do all the part that you can on your side and the results for that are just absolutely amazing yeah no there there really is a lot of power what you can overcome with your mind now just to kind of close off we want to just quickly address a myth a very common myth that's spread around and that's the fact that it takes money to make money now we don't want to just flat out uh, dismiss this and, and disagree it we actually do believe there's partial truth to the statement the thing is that uh, when, when you in an advantage situation that you have money to invest you can certainly make use it to make money quicker and easier but that doesn't necessarily mean that if you don't that you're not able to this is a complete lie so definitely don't believe it all that means is that you're gonna have to figure out a different way so that means you're gonna roll up your sleeves uh, get to work get creative get resourceful and figure out a way there's always a way and again I don't want to throw cliches your way but like they say where there's a will there's a way so building on a budget um, is all about these concepts of just uh, taking your situation not making excuses for them and figure out a way that you can uh, build a business uh, with or without a budget or with a minimal budget so that's what we've been able to do uh, in our own experience even before we were business builders like Adriana said we've been in, in a lot of tight spots we got married very young and we were in a situation often where we had either debt or bills or lack of income and we literally just had to figure out a way we had to cut out maybe expenses that weren't necessary live a little bit outside our comfort zone give up some of the luxuries and uh, do whatever it takes you know in order to to succeed you got to prioritize so uh, with that being said I think we've shared what 
we wanted to share today. Hopefully you've gotten some, uh, some valuable information out, out of this. Uh, and as always, you can follow our link to our website. We've got a lot more uh, cool information to share with, with you always. Um, things about business, things about life, and things that will hopefully inspire you. So thank you as always for, for checking us out, and we'll see you very soon.